What it do, y'all? It's your boy, Mr. 1225, back with another video, back with another banger, back with another topic that's coming straight from the dash, y'all. Dash talk for real, man. And the Nismo, you see it, baby. Big things coming for the car soon. But anyway, let's get into this video. Yes, sir. So, lays on my heart, I wanted to talk to you guys about gentrification, man. I really was gonna dig like super, super deep and get into like the definition of gentrification and you know, the impacts and the pros and cons, but I'm gonna just come off the top of my dome. Like I tell y'all, these dash talks, I, I just, I, I, I get out of my job and I get in my car and I give y'all a dash talk what's on my mind. So I was thinking about gentrification and what I feel like is it a good thing or a bad thing. So. In my opinion, I think it's kind of both, you know what I mean, if, 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 if I can say so. And the re reason why I say that is because, like, um, I see a lot of, you know, people that was in my old neighborhood. I grew up in an area called Kirkwood on the east side of Atlanta, Kirkwood, Georgia. And um, a lot of people in the early 2000s and, um, you know, many people sold their homes for like pennies on a dollar, like little or nothing. Like, yeah, I think you'd probably get a home over there for probably, uh, let's just say 40 grand. And uh, a lot of those families sold and moved on. And then, you know, probably like after 2010, you know, the economy crashed and all that stuff, you know, people started flipping homes and people started buying those homes over there and flipping them for profit. You know, some people stayed, some people left. But majority of everybody over there long gone and some of the original properties, the houses are, are, are torn down. So they basically just bought the house, tore it down, built something else. And um, kind of funny, like two doors down from my grandmother, uh, it was a property that just sold for like $850,000. And I honestly thought Kirkwood was like a historical area. But this house is very modern, like something I would build. Like I, I, I like the house, but I don't like the house being in that area, if I can say so. So, um, I guess it's a good thing. It cleans up the neighborhood. You know, it does bring economy back to the neighborhood. But I, I don't know, man. Y'all let me know in the comments below. Is gentrification a good thing or a bad thing? You know, should they have like programs for those families? Well, probably not now, but maybe in other areas of the city that give them some type of financial literacy when they get money because some of these families don't never ever see this large lump sum of money and you know i've seen a lot of families they blow it go out and get you know whatever they buy and they walk on the streets again so let me know in the comments below is gentrification a good thing or bad thing what is y'all opinion on that um holla at your boy it's mr 1225 on the dash and i'll see you on the next one